Liz Tribe. I'm a GUV instructor and I'm going to talk about cold fingers today. So up in the Pacific Northwest we have these big bulky dry gloves and often get pretty cold fingers. So I have a couple of tricks to help manage your equipment with uh, cold fingers. The first one I'm going to show you, this isn't a standard, but it's something that I learned the hard way when I learned uh, lost a backup light, is if you'll zoom in Jason, you'll notice that I have on my right D-ring, it becomes a pretty busy D-ring. It's got my primary long hose, my backup light, or my primary light, and also my spare double ender. My backup light, you'll notice, is clipped in an opposite direction so that when this D-ring gets very busy, I don't accidentally unclip this backup light and leave it hanging like this, potentially causing it to fall into the bottom of the ocean, never to be found again. 